Hello, welcome to the Spoon for Heart Kitchen. สวัสดีค่ะ My name is Jerry. Today we are doing international chicken collaboration. Before I mention everybody name, I want to tell you first my English is not perfect. My accent is strong, so if I don't say your name right, I apologize. First, we have Valentina from Real Italian Kitchen. Today she making whole lot of chicken with fresh Italian herb. And the second one, Cherry from Kimchi and Cornbread. She are making spicy Korean chicken skewer. Third, we have Laris from Laris Kitchen. She making chicken Manhattan. And the next one, Aditi from Eat is India. So she making chicken masala. Next, we have Ivy from Ivy Kitchen. Today she making chicken afitada. Afitada. <laughs> I hope I said that name right. Next, we have Christina from Eat Meat Kitchen. She are making vegan chicken and waffles. And we have Erin from Erin's Homemade Delight. She will making roasted chicken with s a t c h e s and garlic. We have Paul from k e d i k o e Japan. He making chicken curries. And the wife from the Bangkok f a t t y he making cow soy. The last one is me, Silly from the Spoon Fork Heart Kitchen. I'm making katsu chicken. Please stay here and watch the rest of my video. And when you finish, go check everybody else the chicken recipe. First, we're gonna get all our vegetable cut. I have the red bell pepper. Just use about a little bit for the bell pepper. Yeah, you just can use all red one or, but I want all three different color. So my chicken will be beautiful color. So I use it all three different color. Okay, and for the bell pepper, we will cut into the bite side. Okay, and now we're done with the bell pepper. Now we're gonna cut our onion. It's gonna be the same size with the bell pepper. Okay, for the mushroom, uh, I use the white mushroom today, and I remove the stem a little bit and cut them to be the uh, four pieces. If this side the mushroom will be perfect for the by side. And for the green onion. I will use just the top part, the green part, and cut to be one and a half inch. Next, garlic. We just gonna chop it small. I like to break it down like this first, so all the flavors come out. And now all our vegetable is done, and I will change the cutting board and cut our chicken. Today we are using the chicken breast today, and I will cut the, them to be the cube. Okay, and we're going to cut into the bite side pieces. About this side. Finish cut our chicken, and now we're gonna add our tempura flour, salt, and pepper to the chicken. Use a white pepper, little bit of salt, and tempura flour. For the tempura flour, um, if you don't have, you can use the um, all-purpose flour. But I recommend tempura flour because it uh, give you extra crisp into your chicken. And just mix them. And now I gonna go and wash my hand and sit the chicken on the side, and I will make our sauce. We gonna make our sauce first, so easy when we stir fry this. And first, we have the Thai chili paste. This is my homemade Thai chili paste. I also have the video how to make this. And this, the next one is the fish sauce, oyster sauce, soy sauce. I use golden mountain ban. Sugar, just regular white sugar, and also I have the chicken broth. 
and now we're gonna have to mix it well together our cashew sauce is done our vegetable done and chicken done and now we're gonna go to the stove and to the medium heat and wait until your wok is hot add your oil and then I'm gonna wait a little bit until the oil hot and medium low heat I will fry our dry chili pepper the chili pepper is easy to burn so just be careful the chili pepper will add a smoky flavor so I, I fry the chili pepper first okay and now our chili is done and now we're gonna take it out the color is changed to be darker like this that means the chili is ready same oil, now I'm gonna fry our cashew. I really love the how the cashew nut favored. And also you use the whole cashew nut like this, it will be nicer. And now when the cashew nut start change the color, now we can remove this because the this cashew nut is already cooked. It's raw this cashew nut, but we want to fry them or we'll get the uh, crispy. Now our chili and ketchup is done. Now we're gonna fry our chicken. Use the same oil but make it a little bit hotter. And now we need to add our chicken. Mm. Okay, and now I put the, the one by one because I don't want all the chicken to be uh, stick together. But you have to do this quickly. And then you can mix it at the same time too. And now your chicken change the color to be golden. So now we are done and I gonna remove the chicken. And also this uh, chicken base is easy to cook. You don't want to go overcook for the chicken base. So now I gonna remove and our chicken sit on the side like this for drain all the oil in the same walk i remove all the old oil and put the fresh oil into for we ready to fry our vegetable first i'm gonna put our garlic and now i fry in our garlic until the franken come out and also the garlic is changed the color to be a little bit of brown and now we ready to add our sauce Okay, uh, mix it well and add all the salt. I'm just gonna uh, allow the salt to come into boil. Just, I want the salt to be a little bit uh, thicker from all the sugar and the chili paste. Also, this recipe is um, supposed to be a little bit sweet and a little bit spicy, and you have the smoky flavor from the fried chili. That's how have to taste okay and now the salt is coming to boil and you can see the salt is a little bit thicker already from the sugar and the chili paste now we need to add our vegetable bell, all the bell pepper and onion going mm, look at all this color our mushroom going Just give this a good mix, just a second, because all this vegetable is easy to cook by itself, so just give this a good mix. Just for a second, the vegetable and the salt is mixed well as our chicken. Mm. And now give this a good toss. Mix it well together. So all the salt they mix well together with chicken and the vegetable. And this one not take it long to make at all because you don't want your chicken to be uh, soaky. So because you want a crispy from the chicken too. So now uh, we add our chili and the ketchup. As all, we almost done. And then the now turn off the stove. We done and add our green onion to decorate and give the, all the pretty color and now the stove already off just give this a good mix and now our cashew chicken is done look all the salt cover all the chicken and all vegetable oh, I can't wait to try this 
and here now we done our cashew chicken now i ready to try this okay and i will grab a little bit of one piece of ch um, chicken bell pepper some mushroom and now i ready to try this mm, look at everything they so look beautiful together It's so good. All the sauce cover all the chicken and flavor. I'm ready to try another bite. Now I try with the ketchup. Mm. Wow. Mm. Now the cameraman all the lot with me. He want to eat this like now. He can't wait to try this later. And I tell him if he want to try it, he have to join me in the this a video and here now I make him be the in the camera with me and he ready to try this hi everybody uh, Siri's gonna let me try it now so I feel a little bit lucky I'm gonna get some uh, some chicken a cashew looks like some onion and a yellow bell pepper mmm how's that mm. <laughs> you always cannot wait to try this but this one look really good mm. That's great. The sauce is amazing. Little bit of heat, but not too much. Sweetness. Yes. I love yes. it. We had a great time making this recipe. And I know there's nine other <coughs> collaborators who are also doing awesome chicken dishes. Um, I wrote the names down, so I'm gonna have to read them. Uh, Valentina, you guys gotta go check out her channel. Sherry, Larisse, Aditi, Ivy, Christina, Ellen, Paul and Dwight. <clears throat> All the links to their videos are below. Check them out guys and thank you. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, if you like this recipe, please give that a thumb up, subscribe, and you will see me for the next recipe. Thank you. I'm gonna eat this all now. See, he eat it all now. <laughs> oh good. Oh my god. I know. It's amazing. Yes. Ow, you're not recording. You're not recording it. I did. <laughs> <laughs>